You just said I mean, that only 8% of the place is arguable land. land. I'm, sure, I'm sure they get some arguable land in the prison. They could grow their own chicken. They could grow their own food. They could grow their own crops. And they pick up a scale. You understand? And so what a happens is that... Scale. But we have, we, have some, we, have some, we have some policies that are, you know, I remember Fred Mitchell was saying that, you know, you need to get permission from the governor general to wake up prisoners before 5 o'clock in the morning. What? Something like that. Some, some, some crazy nonsense. So they also get these regulations within the prison. The international rules. And then, I, but, and then also, too, you know, I think we spend X amount of money on cigarettes every year because I remember Mother Pratt when she was minister of... National service, me and her went at it over oh, well, spending cigarette money on prisoners. And, you know, for me, I always took the position as prepaid and postpaid. If you don't invest in your children prepaid, you can invest in them postpaid. So right now, we're spending all this money in the prison, all this money to feed them, to buy them cigarette, to house them, whilst they do nothing. I say, let's make sure we have a work program for them where they could contribute to their own food. They earn their own carbon credits to eat. <laughs> you understand? So you go to work, you, you, you put them in a the farm, let them grow crops, let them sell that crops to the exchange, they make their extra money every week so they can go towards paying for them. We cannot carry them. We got, a, we got a whole bunch of illegal immigrants to carry. Then we got a whole bunch of prisoners to carry. Then we got a whole bunch of everybody to carry. How we can carry everybody and we ain't got no carbon credit to sell like Levan say, we, ain't no, we don't produce no carbon so we ain't getting nothing to sell. Economics is basic. And either, so, either you reduce the cost of intake <laughs> or... What? We find a supplemental way of finding new income, new streams of That's income. my point, because the prison doesn't generate money. And so, so either you need way, to cut the cost exactly. Let it be or enough. reduce the population. And then you get, you get a bunch, you get a lot of, you get a lot of uh, 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 construction workers and masons and so on there. Source their talent out, those who perhaps are already almost on their time. Source them out to the construction workers, let their pay come back to them. Part go towards the prison, but part go towards no, them. No, see, then you, the cases, then you run into legal issues, right? Because is that a part of what their sentencing was? My sentencing wasn't to any sort of labor of any kind. I am in prison for the crime that I've committed. I intend to lay here mm -hmm. like a plywood for 23 hours a day, and I don't want anybody to touch you me, ask me to do anything. You don't think a prisoner would be happy yeah, to know that, that, that I, when just they that leave prison, they have some money to look forward to that's but, been... But, Shanique, you have to consider people's legal rights. You can't say because the man is a prisoner, he has yeah. vacated himself of all legal before, rights. You know, right? You all have the song, That's the sound of the man working, working on the chain. Yeah. Yay. Yay. Put them Yay. Yay. That was that 1950s. So, put them in, put, so uh, why, why does it work then and it can't work now? Yeah, it works. Civil if he could change the law. Um, civil rights. I, 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 change, I, change the law. Change, change the law. No, no, no. All I, it takes I, something good. obviously has to be done, and I'll tell you, it's awesome for them to pick up a wonderful skill that's yeah. useful in and out of prison to learn how to farm. Mm. Huh? Imagine that. Imagine, Imagine that's, that's that. just really awesome.